today is good friday uh two days to the easter period so but uh, we are moving around Oka to give you the situation on what is happening in Oka. also you want to look at the traffic situation and uh, how traffic has built up in Oka because of the easter and also to give you the detailed information about the installation of electronics billboard on the flyover so but we've just started from aroma here we are sure that uh, there is no one at aroma except if they can do it later well uh, this is good friday you can see this accident just occurred here thank god it just uh, crashed on its own they don't went to hit another vehicle that will cause injury to others so but i wonder what could have happened that this vehicle crashed here yeah, that place is a hilly place it's not that it felt break or what well i don't know for sure probably he's struggling with another vehicle while overtaking i don't know what to say so but uh, the thing is that the vehicle crashed at the mid section of this expressway and uh, the items inside the vehicle the trailer poured on the way and i wish that the owners would come and pack them too quickly to avoid any further damage this mesh you can see this mesh this uh, this thing that looks like a net it's called mesh so this thing now a lot of them has gone off uh, you know it needs to be replaced if government wants that thing to remain there if not it looks very rough you know uh, some are there some are not there so it has to be replaced and um, replaced in a way that it cannot be easily tampered with that is the point so we are moving down to water flyover we want to see the billboard to know if it's there at water but i know that billboard has been installed according to the information that we got this is music temporary site and uh, you can see how clean and open the place is well a lot of work has still remaining to be done in a number of states even though some have been done gradually gradually the main thing is to be moving forward and not backward or standing still so yes like i said today is good friday and uh, we want to focus majorly on that amobia amobia flyover because in terms of traffic situation or that's what i'm talking about the billboard on we are going to observe it here at water so but the traffic situation on we'll check how amobia is looking like because amobia is always the problem now okay see the billboards here they are yet to be unveiled to see the writings on them so these are the electronic billboard at each electric pole or at intervals well that's a nice one but um, we are going to have another view of it we are going to use the other lane so we can have the uh, view a better view of it so but as we are about doing that we are moving down to Amobia flyover so like i was saying Amobia flyover has one traffic road movement the other lane has been blocked again meaning that vehicles are not allowed to use it because rcc is doing some work along that lane if possible they would have allowed the road to be passable for now until probably after easter then they will close it back again that would have been my suggestion but um well um they have taken their decisions so what is remaining for the general public is to be notified and uh, let them do the correct thing to avoid 
crashes you know um, uh, crashes accident on the road do you know that they kill more than any other disease in, in the world the whole of the world though some countries have uh, zero accidents yes there are some countries countries like uh, i think sweden sweden or netherlands also they have zero crash in some years nothing like accident nothing like injury from accident to show you how organized these countries are so but um in nigeria we strive as much as possible to reduce these uh, crashes that uh, we are witnessing on the road so that um you know um, people will likely not to get themselves involved in crashes so if we have any information that will help road users we try as much as possible to disseminate it so that um, it will be beneficial to everybody that is using the road both pedestrian both uh, motorists cyclists and a whole lot of them so we are glad to let you know that uh, the other lane is still blocked that uh, you can only follow or face traffic on the other lane that's the uh, orca bound lane if you are going to nature so that is the way it is now so right now we are moving down towards some of the flyover we are approaching the flyover now and i still want to observe whether there is any electronic uh, listing on there but uh, if there is any place it should be it should be at home and not here because this one is not uh, fully functional it's just one lane that is uh, usable for now so i don't think okay there is nothing here the billboards are not here electronics billboards they are not here so gentlemen if you observe the other lane though there is police checkpoint there but the traffic has started building up it's not like this ordinary days you can see the traffic is building up and uh, the people in charge of uh, you know stop and check which is the police they are doing a great work but uh, they should you know um, make it faster so that this vehicle should not queue up on top of a flyover you know, it's not always the best flyovers are meant for vehicles to just come and pass you know so um, uh, we are going to follow under the flyover to have our reverse view because want to see that um electronic billboard the front we want to see the front very well and uh, see how it looks like so you can see it, though this vehicle probably is going somewhere there is not going to cross that market if you are going into market no problem you can go to market and still follow here come down here and follow one way so but uh, we we are just turning here to observe uh, the billboard and uh, know the traffic situation so viewers here now uh, you can see the traffic build up you can see coming down from that flyover it doesn't used to be like this before so gradually traffic is building up people are coming home you know our people they love to come home whenever there is festive period and there are usually occasions occasion of burial traditional marriage are usually fixed after festivities immediately after festivities they usually fix it because people usually come home that period it has become a custom an Igbo man has to visit home the hometown hometown the person is from you know um, uh, at least once in a year at least once in a year 
or more depends on how far the person is where he's staying how far the place is if he's near or if the person decides he can come home but at least once that once usually is on you know a christmas period but there is not a stamp and the sign no people can decide to come anytime home to see their home and have one or two things done at home so that is the custom of an Igbo man So by the left is the uh, entrance to Ngozika Estate, by the left that's across the expressway, we just passed it now. So shortly we are going to be in front of Udoka Estate, after Udoka Estate, then we are going to climb the quarter flyover to see the billboard very well. So from the look of things now, it's only at Quarter Flyover that the billboard is, uh, which is uh, not bad. Now we are climbing the flyover, we want to have a closer look of it. So you can see the billboards now, you can see them probably a lot of advertisement will be there and uh, they should consider, you know, telling people not to litter the environment of Okao. That, uh, you know, enforcement people will be moving around to checkmate those stuff. These are the things that are to be advertised on this billboard and the other things also. Well, um, we have confirmed it and we have moved around. And uh, if you ask me, there is no need going to Rome again because we came down from Rome and we saw that uh, the billboard is not there. So, like I said earlier, this mesh people have tampered with them a lot. That it looks like uh, you know uh, it's not looking fine again. It looks like an old woman's teeth. No, some are there, some are not there. So it's not fine. They need to either replace them or, you know, after replacement, they will find a way to make it to be steady. Well, with this, we come to the end of this discussion. My name is Steve Chinedu, and if you have not subscribed to Yanga Life, please click on the subscription button, notification bell. Let's have your view about this video. Thank you as you do that. I wish you merry. Yes, I almost concluded. I wish you merry Easter. So, but uh, I thought ah, Easter is not always goes with uh, Mary, it goes with a uh, happy Easter. But I wonder why people don't use Mary during Easter, but they use happy during Easter. Probably Easter is uh, not like that, such merriment is not expected, or what? I don't know. Well, um, until I come your way next time, bye for now.